Hi, I'm Martina and welcome to the A4 Autobahn in Germany. It's closed, or this bit is. Nobody's driving at high speed here. It's been diverted to the south because the Germans are digging a remarkably large hole. This is Tagebau Hambach in Germany's industrial heartland near Köln. This is one of the largest holes in the world and has swallowed towns as well as motorways. It's very difficult to get across the sheer size of this hole in footage. For example, these bucket wheel excavators are huge. One of them, Bagger 293, is 93 metres tall, so is the tallest and among the heaviest and longest vehicles or movable machines ever built. The others here are of similar size. This isn't even the only huge hole in this area. There are several, including Gartsweiler a little to the north. Like Hambach, Gartsweiler has also swallowed towns and autobahns. Here you can see a mostly abandoned cloverleaf interchange. The route of the autobahn it served stretches over the edge of the hole. Here it has been converted into a tourist attraction and viewing platform, with Germans as well as British YouTubers staring into the abyss. Gartsweiler is also home to the more famous bucket wheel excavator Bagger 288, which was driven here from Hambach in 2001. I can't emphasise enough just how big these holes are. The larger hole at Hambach covers 44 square kilometres and is roughly the size of Coventry or Milton Keynes and half a kilometre deep, deeper than any building in Europe is tall. It's not even finished and is planned to double in size to 85 square kilometres. This is all in aid of mining lignite, or brown coal, transported directly by conveyor belt to the many large coal-fired power stations in the area, as well as being loaded onto trains and taken elsewhere. Currently, lignite generates 20% of Germany's electricity, with hard black coal generating a further 10%. The relevant figures for the UK are 0 and 1.5%. These figures for Germany are from before the Russian invasion of Ukraine and its effects on natural gas supplies, so Germany is probably even more reliant on lignite now. There is a commitment to phase out coal power in Germany by 2038. Lignite is the dirtiest coal, producing more of other pollutants as well as CO2. As you've seen, its mining is quite destructive too. Germany's power stations produce around 230 million tonnes of CO2 per year, as much as 100 million cars give or take. Feel free to comment with a better calculation, or click one of the buttons if you like this video. I've got at least another two that I've already got footage for and need to edit now. I'm Martina and thank you for looking at things with me.